Hi guys, hope you are all fine. Today we will be seeing an activity which is really cool and fun to do. This activity helps in developing good hand muscle strength and uh, this improves hand eye coordination. This activity keeps your kids busy for long. So let's quickly check into the video. We are going to make a spider web using glue. We are going to do this activity with simple materials available at home. All you need is a plain transparent sheet or a cover, transparent cover white sheet ruler sketch or marker glue a rope of any material available at your home old cardboard sheets or boxes so now on this white sheet i'm going to draw a rough sketch of a spider web now place this uh, sheet inside the transparent cover if you are using OHP sheet now place the paper on the floor or on the table above that you can keep the OHP sheet and on the all uh, corners just stick with the cello tape now trace the spider web using white glue I am using plain white glue you can also use glittered glue just to make it look real I am using plain white glue to make it interesting you can also use colored glue if you are following me you will know in all my videos I am repeatedly saying this involve kids a lot in the activity only then they will gain knowledge and interest this type of activity develops muscle strength like squeezing the glue so let the kids trace it I know kids cannot do it perfectly you teach them once let them trace it and finally you can do touch ups here and there So now the tracing is done, leave it to dry completely. It's dried completely, now you can peel it off. While tracing you give a thick outline only then while peeling you will get a solid shape and you can avoid breakage and peel only if it is dried completely or you may tend to break it. After peeling it will look little shrinked you can but uh, bring it to the shape. After drying glue will become completely transparent so I am going to color this white. I am going to give this work to my child I am helping him as well. Paint it completely and let it dry and meanwhile you can make a spider using old cardboard box. Draw outline of the spider on the cardboard box, cut it, paint it and that's all. So the spider web is ready, here comes the spider. Spider you can make it by yourself, kids will not be able to do this and if you don't know how to draw a spider you can google the image and you can take a printout, cut it and paste it on a cardboard sheet and cut along the outline. Spider is ready. Now take a rope, preferably white, um, cello tape, a scissor. We are going to stick the spiders on both the ends of the rope. You can use cello tape or the same glue which used for tracing. Before sticking the spider, insert the rope inside the spider web uh, as shown in the video. Actually how the kids are going to play with this activity is like if the kid pulls one spider down, the other spider will move up. So the length of the rope is up to you. If you want the spider to hang low, you can use a long rope or make it short as per your wish. Let's stick the spider on both the ends. All done finally it looks like this stick this on a wall or on a door or on any medium where the kids can reach try it for sure and not only spider web you can draw simple pictures like a car a flower a house and you can uh, let the child to trace with the glue and let the kids peel it off once it's dried children will definitely love this and this will keep kids busy for long that's all about the activity hope you like it if you like the video do please give a like and do share the video subscribe the channel for more such interesting videos and don't forget to hit the bell icon so that you will not miss any of my videos thanks for watching